Ford is a leader in the development of battery electric vehicles. Earlier this year it unveiled the Tourneo Connect BEV and last week it announced it was developing a fleet of electric focus prototypes. The Tourneo Connect BEV is developed with UK-based Smith Electric Vehicles, part of the Tanfield Group. We have a collaboration agreement with Ford in both North America and in Europe. The North American uh, collaboration is, is focused entirely on the uh, Transit Connect vehicle. The European collaboration agreement that we have with Ford is for us to develop electric versions of the Ford Transit commercial vehicle and the Ford Transit Connect product. In addition, we've recently been working on some new conceptual products, including the Ford Torneo. The vehicles are converted at the Tanfield plant in Northern England. Well, when we get in a, a bare van, obviously, we, we start then to integrate a lot of our technology. So obviously the, the, the vehicle comes in with, with, uh, with no engine, gearbox, uh, cooling system, exhaust system or fuel tank. And we will then look to integrate all of our propulsion technology which actually drives the vehicles. The, the, the electric drive system, the, the electronic controls and power controls. And then of course the battery system itself which, which provides the power to the, to the motor uh, is all integrated into the vehicle. In addition to the Tourneo Connect, a battery electric transit is available in Europe as the Smith Edison. The Smith Ampere, a battery transit connect, will be available from 2010. We see our relationship with Ford continuing to grow. Um, we think we'll, we'll be offering a, a greater range of product based on, on both the connect uh, and uh, transit platforms. Uh, we see opportunities obviously to take some of this technology into the passenger car side of the business also. But we think in working closely with Ford we can help really to set the, 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 the road map for the next generation of electric vehicles. Tomorrow, FCN takes a close look at the battery technology used and the performance it delivers.